Well done, commanders. Titan Oya is now in Meltdown, and it is expected to go into some flashy version of a supernova sometime in 19 hours or so. So depending on where you are in the world at some point in the day on Sunday. As we now have completed operations at Oya and all that's left is to watch the fireworks for those who want to hang around at the location of a Titan, the question of what's next starts rearing its head. The next target as agreed upon by uh, Defense Council Humanity participants will be Titan Haddad. It is the most accessible target considering the number of systems that it has, which on my last count between controls, alerts, and invasions that stood at 64, compared to some of the others which can have currently over 100. So Haddad will be next in the sort of dreading thing of Haddad proper, which was the uh, unapproachable supercruise distance of the Titan from the supercruise, uh, from the hyperspace drop spot has mostly been resolved with the introduction of supercruise overcharge drives. In the meanwhile, you may have seen from my other video published yesterday that Titan weapons, uh, pardon me, Guardian weapons, are now uh, available for use in Titan space with a modification made available by Ramta, uh, even though based on my analysis to date, they don't fundamentally alter the nature of the best builds that we have to strike Titans and consequently are more of a can rather than must type of arrangement for you to try out and experiment with and see what your mileage is with. So from here on out, we're expecting what is likely to be a month and a half to two months, depending on the number of alerts or additional alerts that we'll have to deal with and at the velocity that we can realistically clear systems around Haddad, which as always will start faster as the systems that are further from the Titan requires require fewer effort to um, to deal with versus the ones that are on the interior side will require more. Nevertheless, we're looking at a campaign to reduce the control systems around Haddad of several weeks at the very least, up to a couple of months if things don't go particularly fast. With that, I hope you enjoy the fireworks, commanders, tomorrow, and uh, well done, all of you. And it's been a pleasure flying and fighting and seeing many of you in system chat as we were all hitting Oya together in one massive coordinated campaign after an incredibly successful sampling campaign and even some surprises with the 30 alerts that uh, Oya threw at us and that were masterfully dealt with uh, the week prior to this this final clearing of the systems and the uh, ultimate strike of Oya. So glory to mankind, Commander Mekin, over and out.